the X1 was, a, to me, uh, you know, sort of fly twice a week airplane. It, it took two or three days to reduce the data from your flight. It was a complex airplane to get serviced with liquid oxygen, alcohol, nit and, and gaseous nitrogen. And uh, in the meantime, I'm flying about 15 different other airplanes every day uh, on different test programs. So it was a hard grind. The X-1 was a, to me, was a pleasure to fly because, you know, you weren't crammed or, or really crowded in, in doing test work. And uh, you took the whole day to do it. And it uh, just so happens uh, that particular flight, I think, was on a Tuesday. Uh, on the weekends there at, Ed, at Miroc, it was called then, uh, we used to uh, go out to Poncho Barnes uh, or sort of a, she had a rodeo grounds and a swimming pool and motel and, and a good restaurant. You go out there and, and, you know, unwind. And I took Glennis out there, I think, on a, on a Saturday night. And, and we loved to ride horses. So we went out after dinner and we're riding horses and chasing each other. And coming back, somebody had closed the gate and it was dark and I didn't see it. So my horse hit the fence and flipped me and I broke a couple of ribs. And uh, that was on a Saturday night. Sunday, I moped around and then Monday, I had to go into the base, and, and I, I went to a, a local doctor there, and he said, we've got two, crack, two busted ribs. I'll tape you up. And, and it, it really didn't make that much difference in flying the airplane because it's not strenuous other than handling it with your, your hands and feet on the rudder pedals and, and the control surfaces and loading pressure domes and turning switches on, things like that. So, so uh, my only problem was... Uh, it was painful to get into the airplane because you had to come down a ladder and go through a little hole on the right side. But then the hard part was closing the door. Once old Jack Ridley came down the ladder and held the door against the right side, had a lever. It was really tough to, and it took both hands all you could do. And I couldn't handle it with my right side because handle. So he made me a, about a 10 inch long broomstick and I could stick in the end of the door handle and give me that mechanical advantage. And that's the way we solved the problem. So. But it really didn't, didn't make much difference.